Hi there, this is Gabby with NextGen Real Estate and Property Management, serving Chicago land and their real estate needs. And if you want to stay connected, subscribe to get updated on our latest content. And also, as always, you can find a link below to schedule a free consultation with me. Today, I'm so excited to discuss a little more about the place I call home, which is Barrington. Now, residents, business owners, village government, and civic leaders work very hard to make Barrington a great place to live, work, and play. Barrington is also one of the safest places to live in with a lower crime rate than other suburban areas, statewide and nationwide. Our schools are consistently among the top in state and national rankings. Located just 40 miles from Chicago, you can access all metropolitan amenities while enjoying the amazing varieties of outdoor recreation and parks, forest preserves, and horse and hiking trails. But it's not all sunshines and daisies here, as you will see in the con list. Now let's get down to business. Let's start with the benefits of being a Barrington resident. Number one, safe community. Even if it's just 40 miles away from Chicago, safety is a high point for people who visit and live in Barrington. It's super safe that I can walk in the night or run at 5 a.m. without worrying. Unlike the national average of 282.7, violent crime in Barrington only refers to as assault with a rate of 18.5, which is 93% lower than the national average. With regards to property crime, burglaries, thefts, and vehicle thefts are 72%, 68%, and 76% lower than the national average. Number two, close-knit community. After you see how safe it is to live in Barrington, you'll love the close-knit community in this quaint suburb. It offers a lot of diverse resources for people of all ages. There are small family-run shops and restaurants, calm coffee shops, various parks, supportive schools, and resourceful library. Five towns fall under Barrington city boundaries. Downtown is where everybody congregates daily. This community has all sorts of homes. There are a lot of McMansions and old money estates that welcome new owners daily. From its bustling farmer's market in the fall or the lights that line the town during the wintry months, leading to Christmas, Barrington is a wonderful place to live, work, and raise your family. Number three, nature. Barrington is renowned for its greenery. Nature lovers would love visiting the many nature preserves and parks throughout the village. Since 1986, Barrington has been recognized by Arbor Day Foundation as being Tree City USA. Biking or driving amid the horse farms and vast estates is a treat in itself. The Riding Club of Barrington Hills maintains a vast network of trails that crisscrosses over areas through both public and private land, providing many opportunities to view scenic beauty on horseback. Golfers in particular enjoy the Public McRae Memorial Golf Club along many other public clubs. Other outdoorsy people enjoy the many preserves surrounding our community in both Lake and Cook counties, including Crabtree Nature Preserve, Deer Grove Preserve, Spring Creek Preserve, Cuba Marsh, and Grassy Lake Preserve. Barrington is also just a few miles from the Fox River, a boating and water recreational mecca leading all the way to the Chainstow Lakes near the Wisconsin border. Number four, Park District. Take advantage of Barrington Park District. Its major facilities include Langendorf Park. Langendorf Park and its recreational center offer an outdoor pool, splash pad, playgrounds, and ball fields, a par three golf course, indoor gym, and basketball courts, pavilions, community rooms, and programming. Citizens Park and Pepper Family Treehouse. Citizens Park features a walking, biking, jogging path that connects to Cuba Marsh, a vast open field for passive recreation, a playground, a handicapped accessible tree house, and numerous indoor and outdoor pavilions for parties and gatherings, as well as ice skating and some of Chicago area's best cross-country skiing. Beast Park. Beast Park is a large park featuring a playground and numerous ball fields used by sports team in the area. 
a stellar education system with award-winning schools. If you are looking for a place to raise children and foster scholastic excellence, you really should consider Barrington. Barrington is known for its multi-award public school system. It is very challenging and successful in producing top-notch graduates that move on to college and high-paying careers. The Barrington School District 220 is the gem of the community. It covers 11 schools that provide education for students in grades kindergarten to 12, as well as two learning centers for early preschool education. The single high school, Barrington High School, educates children grades 9 to 12, with two middle schools, Prairie Campus and Station Campus, do so for those in the 6th through the 8th grade. We also have eight elementary schools that serve students in kindergarten through 5th grade. We also have St. Anne School, which is a Catholic school that provides education for children from kindergarten through 8th grade. Barrington, being an award-winning district, is still operating with a balanced budget for 22 consecutive years. So the state of Illinois confers the highest financial rating upon the community. But as much as I love Barrington, it is my fiduciary duty to inform you of the things that you should be wary of here. As with anything, the community is not perfect. It has some flaws that any new home buyer should be aware of. So here we go with the list of the cons. And number one, high cost of living. Living in Barrington can overwhelm your finances if you don't budget well. Barrington is considered an affluent neighborhood due to high home prices and high property taxes. According to Redfin, in November 2021, Barrington home prices went up 12% compared to last year, selling for a medium price of $605,000. The average rent for a three bedroom apartment in Barrington is $3,250. Another thing that makes living in Barrington very expensive is the property taxes. For instance, a homeowner pays property taxes of over $6,000 for a newer home with approximately 2,200 square feet and one third acre lot. Number two, you must have a car to get around. While the downtown Barrington area is very walkable, a car is a must due to wide range and shopping on outskirts of the town. The only public metro will take you outside of the village. Number three, traffic in downtown area. While the Barrington Metro Station provides a critical transportation option for commuters, it also brings significant traffic to the village center during morning and evening rush hours. The recent acquisition of the Algin Joliet and Eastern Railway by Canadian National presents new transportation obstacles for Barrington. All things considered, the pros of living in Barrington outweigh the cons by a large margin. The community provides a nice suburban environment with metropolitan conveniences. It's very safe and welcoming. And its crowning jewel is the Barrington School District 220, which has earned several awards on a balanced budget. Even as people may go out of town when they grow up, many return to Barrington to raise their families in this stunning neighborhood. What do you think about Barrington? Share your experiences about this place in the comments below. Interested in chatting with me about your real estate needs? Book a free consultation in the link below. Thanks for watching, and as always, where's your future?